Hi folks, you're tuned into Business Today TV. I'm Sakshi Batra. Well, the IPO rush continues on the D Street as three more IPOs are all set to hit the street this week alone to raise about 2,400 crore rupees via the initial public offer. Now, the first IPO is by a fertilizer company which is called Paradeep Phosphates, which will open on Tuesday, that's May 17th. The IPO by luxury watch retail player Ethos will also open this week on Wednesday, May 18th, and the IPO by E Mudza. India's largest license certifying authority will now open on Friday, that is May 20th of this week alone. Now, in the case of Paradeep Phosphates, which is a 1,502 crore rupees IPO, the company has already raised 450 crores from the anchor investors, including Goldman Sachs, BNP Paribas, Kuber India Fund, Coptal Mauritius Investment and Society General. Now, the issue comprises of fresh issue of equity shares about 1,000 odd crore rupees and an offer for sale of 11.85 crore equity shares. Now, as part of the OFS, Suari, Maroc, uh, the first phase will actually offload over 60 lakh equity shares and the government of India will also sell over 11.2 lakh shares, equity shares in the company. And the government will be offloading its entire 19.55% stake in the company via the IPO. The price band for this IPO is 39 rupees to 42 rupees per share. So very uh, small ticket IPO, if you can say this one is going to be. Now, in the case of Ethos, the price band for uh, the 472 crore rupees IPO has been fixed between 836 to 878 rupees per equity share. So the stock price, uh, the issue price is somewhere on the higher side. And this public offer will also consist of a fresh issue of equity shares aggregating to 375 odd crore rupees and uh, an offer for sale as well. Now, Ethos has 50 physical retail stores in 17 cities in India. It is in a multi-store format and offers an omni experience to its customers through its website as well as through its social media platforms as well. As part of the OFS, the shareholders including Yashwardhan Sabu, KDDL, Mahi Distribution, Sabu Ventures, Anuradha Sabu, Jayvardhan Sabu will also get exit uh, by offloading the shares in this IPO. Now, half of the issue size of Ethos IPO is actually reserved for the qualified institutional investors. 35% is reserved for retail investors and the remaining 15% is there for the non-institutional investors. Now, investors can therefore bid for a minimum of 17 equity shares and in multiples thereafter. The company's revenue from operations stand at somewhere around 386 crore rupees for the fiscal year 2021, while its net profit was somewhere around 5.78 crore rupees uh, in the same period. Meanwhile, the IPO of a 412 crore IPO of digital signature certificates provider eMutra will open for the public on May 20th, that is coming Friday, and will conclude on May 24th. The bidding for anchor investors will open on May 19th. Now, the company has definitely cut the size of the fresh issue uh, from 200 crores that was planned earlier to 161 crore rupees. This also follows the Bengaluru-based company allocating over 16 lakh shares uh, for 39 crores under the pre-IPO placement. Now, Besides this, there will be an offer for sale of 98.35 lakh shares by the promoters and the exiting shareholders too. Now, as part of the OFS, the promoters, Venkatraman Srivasan, also uh, Tara PTE Limited, will offer somewhere around 33 lakh equity shares and 45 lakh equity shares respectively. In addition, there will be uh, a divestment of Kaushik Srinivasan, who will divest 5.1 lakh equity shares, and Lakshmi Kaushik, who will divest 5.04 lakh equity shares via this IPO too. Now, the proceeds for the fresh issue uh, from this uh, IPO will be utilized to repay the debt, support the working capital requirements, purchase equipment, and pay for the other related costs for the data centers proposed to be set up in India and overseas as well. The amount will also be used up for uh, developing products, investment in eMudra Inc. and for general corporate purposes as well. The company is, uh, in fact, engaged in the business of providing digital trust services and enterprise solutions to individuals and organizations functioning in various industries. So that's all about the three IPOs that are all set to hit this street this time around. Uh, remember, for uh, uh, the first IPO, that is Paradeep uh, Phosphates, uh, the uh, you know price band is at 39 rupees to 42 rupees per equity share. Ethos IPO details, uh, the IPO price is 836 to 878 rupees per equity share. The lot size is 17 shares for one lot. Also for eMutra, the price band has been fixed between 243 to 256 rupees per equity share. And uh, the lot size is one lot is going to be having giving you a 
you know, exposure to 58 shares as has been decided by the company so far. So uh, that's all in the primary market action, a whole lot to start off right from tomorrow. So do stay tuned on to Business Today TV to catch all the updates of uh, what is the kind of action that you're seeing in the primary market buzz. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe. 